Hi, I'm Derek Fairfield, the MDR Email Product Manager, and welcome to a video tutorial on the new Email Campaign Manager dashboard. Really excited about getting you all set up on the new dashboard if you're not set up already. So this tutorial is going to walk you through what the dashboard includes. To start, once we've logged in, you'll always be defaulted to the email dashboard screen, which you can see in the top nav. This is a starting point to show you what's currently trending in terms of your email metrics. So these are KPIs or knowledge performance indicators, uh, being delivered emails, total open rate, total click-through rate, and opt-out rate. So as you can see, we're looking at current quarter to date versus prior quarter to date. We could also change that to look at the current month to date uh, or current year to date. And essentially what this does is it gives you a quick look at whether you're up or you're down. So in this example, we can see that our open rate and our total click-through rate are both up by over 30% um, compared to last quarter through the same date. And it's important to know that we keep the number of days even. So if you're looking at a current quarter to date, it will be the same number of days as prior quarter to date to keep uh, the comparison fair. So this is really a starting point. It's an overall snapshot of your account with us. Um, and to get more detail, we can go into uh, the other tabs up here at the top. To keep things simple, I'm going to go uh, left to right and we'll look at campaigns in progress. And this is exactly like it sounds. Uh, with the new ECM dashboard, you no longer need to keep all of the emails you receive to work on creating the campaign or deploying the campaign. Once you log in, campaigns in progress will show everything in your account that you can work on. Simply click on the campaign name to drill in uh, and start uh, creating the campaign, uploading assets. And none of that process has changed. So um, click on the, the campaign name and just follow the normal ECM process. Deployed campaigns, um, this gives you, you know, further enhancement into getting insight and, uh, and access to data in your account. So here we can do a lot of things in terms of sorting, filtering, um, going back in time, so 30 days, 60 days, 6 months, 12 months, or back several years to look at very specific uh, accounts. Um, there's many different um, data points that you can include, subject line, um, open rates, total click rates, deliverables. So you really can drill down, um, get lots of detail. One example of this is on campaigns that have a trigger or that might be test and roll, you can see the breakdown of each uh, piece of the campaign. So the main message, the free hot lead responder cell, and you can see you know, the different uh, specific open rate or click-through rate for each cell. And at any time, you can always click on the name of the campaign and get into the traditional campaign analyzer report. This data is also exportable. So you can export to Excel and you know, do some analysis um, on your desktop if, if need be. Custom reports. Here, here is uh, a section where there's a lot of power, um, a lot of ability to run um, you know, custom reporting based on either your overall account for a time period. For example, I could go back to, let's say, the start of the school year. Um, and then from there, we'll, we'll say September 1 through today, I could see all the campaigns. So this dynamically populates this campaign's dropdown. So now I can include you know, either a, a portion or check and exclude certain campaigns. So you can really get down to um, a level of granularity that's, that's very uh, useful and helpful. So you can start to see where you're performing well, you know, over either what time periods, what types of campaigns. And then you can get a lot of different um, reports generated based off of this data. So we can look at not only the open rate and click-through rates, things like day of the week, uh, time of day, month of year, um, enrollment level. And that could be school enrollment, district enrollment, uh, college level enrollment, job titles. 
um, you know, by state, for example. So there's a lot of uh, you know capabilities here, and you know, this gives you the ability to to run all of that on you know either a date range or a specific campaign level. So I hope you enjoyed this quick overview of the new email campaign manager dashboard. It's going to really enhance uh, the MDR email uh, you know that you're going accustomed to. Um, and so be on the lookout uh, for other tutorials within the tool if you need assistance on getting up to speed. Thank you.